we've seen this transition of it going from illegal, strong enforcement, a priority, being really reduced as it's gone down to medical use, as it's gone down to recreational use. Tom Sinan's had a front row seat to that evolution over his three plus decades in law enforcement. Newtown's police chief and the head of Hamilton County's Addiction Response Coalition says this move acknowledges their medical benefits to marijuana. Now it goes down to more of a Tylenol codeine kind of classification and saying that it's having a medical, it has some sort of medical potential. Sinan says this doesn't change the drug's legality at the federal level, but it would get federal laws in line with more and more states that are easing regulations on marijuana. There's still going to be a lot of confusion and from a law enforcement perspective. He says it's really up to federal agencies and individual departments how to enforce the laws. When it's confusing, we're obviously going to be on a side of probably not enforcing as strictly as we would. I can't remember the last time I had somebody charged with trafficking, just trafficking in marijuana. Veteran defense attorney Jay Clark says Ohio has always separated marijuana and its penalties from other Schedule One drugs. They don't really, they don't charge it. If marijuana was to move to that Schedule Three level, Clark says lawmakers in Columbus will have to take a hard look at the existing laws. Ohio's going to have to clean it up a little bit, but then you're also going to have 49 other states who treat marijuana 49 different ways. But this is just the start of a long process. And there's still got to be a lot of rules put in place, a lot of guidelines. Now the DEA's proposal still has to be approved by the White House and if they sign off then there's a public comment period before the agency publishes the final rule. That decision is still months away. Thanks for checking out Local 12's YouTube channel. Click the links and hit subscribe so you can be notified anytime we post new stories.